Hey, Chibis! <laughs> this is Lord Bob Hickman of the Order of the Purple Cord. I am so glad to be with you. So many of you have been writing. You've been saying, Psychic Bob, are you going to do some more Wiccan videos? We want to learn more about the Order of the Purple Cord. Well, I heard your, your calls and, and I'm here. You know, today I woke up and I was feeling very very reflective about my spirituality. And uh, I said, you know, I'm going to get my witch on today. So I put on my purple hat. I got on my robes. How you like these, huh? I got my staff. I got my purple cord on. Purple cord is a symbol of our order. Well, I'm so glad you guys are here with me. And so many of you have been writing and saying, Psychic Bob, tell us a little bit more about Wicca. A lot of you are new here. You don't really know about Wicca. You're kind of curious on the fence. Well, I've got a wonderful thing to read for you today. This is a document. It's called The Nature of Our Way. It's a two-page document. You can get this over at rarewiccaspells.com. Lady Angela, our high priestess, sells this document. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Um, the original was penned by, I believe it was Scott Cunningham, who also um, loved this and believed in it. And Lady Angela carries it. And I really recommend uh, that you consider getting this and studying it. I think it's a wonderful reminder of, you know, kind of where our focus should be as Wiccans. And... I wanted to kind of uplift you today with this inspirational reading. So why don't you pull up your chairs here, gather around, let's have a little circle, and we're going to have a reading of the nature of our way. All right, starting here on the first page, <clears throat> the nature of our way. As often as possible, hold the rights and forests by the seashore on deserted mountaintops or near tranquil lakes. If this is impossible, a garden or some, some chamber shall suffice if it is rayed with fumes and flowers. Seek out wisdom in books, rare manuscripts, and cryptic poems, if you will, but seek it out also in simple stones and fragile herbs, and in the cries of wild birds. Listen to the whisperings of the wind and the roar of the water, if you would discover magic. For it is here that the old secrets are preserved. Books contain words. Trees contain energies and wisdom that books never dreamt of. Ever remember the old ways, ever remember, excuse me, ever remember that the old ways are constantly revealing themselves. Therefore be as the river willow that bends and sways with the wind. That which remains changeless shall outlive its spirit, but that which evolves and grows will shine for centuries. There can be no monopoly on wisdom. Therefore, share what you will of your ways with others who seek them, but hide mystic lore from the eyes of those who would destroy, for to do otherwise increases their destruction. Mock not the rituals or spells of another, for who can say yours are greater in power and wisdom? Ensure that your actions are honorable, for all that you do shall return to you threefold, good or bane. Be wary of one who would dominate you, who would control and manipulate your workings and reverences. True reverence for the goddess and God occur within. Look with suspicion on any who would twist worship from you, for their own gain or glory, but welcome those priestesses and priests who are suffused with love. 
Honor all living things, for we are all of the bird, the fish, the bee. Destroy not life, save it be to preserve your own. And this is the nature of our way. Isn't that beautiful? I really, I really love that. And, you know, I think it's so good for those of us. Many of us here have practiced Wicca for years. And, you know, Wicca, like any faith, we can just get caught into the routine. And documents like this remind us to go back, back to basics, back to the energies that first draw, drew us to the craft. You know, I have a lovely little plant here. Many of you have seen it. This is my jade plant. His name is Jude. And when I saw Jude, he was at a, um, at a, a, a pharmacy store. They had a shipment come in and the people in the shop just left the, the plants laying out on a rack, didn't give them any attention or love. And when I got him, he was dehydrated, was very minuscule, didn't think he'd make it. But I talked to this plant every day. I loved it. I got to know its energies and I gave it healing. And now he's growing strong and beautiful. You see, before Wicca, I don't think I would have had the sensitivity to understand the consciousness of a plant. And that's one of the things that Wicca did for me. It brought me an awareness of the sanctity of life on all levels. And so I just, you know, today I just want to share that with you. I want to encourage you, go back to the basics. Rediscover the mysteries of life. Rediscover the beauty of the earth the stars, the sun, the moon. And if you think about it, stop by Rare Wicca Spells. Pick up a copy of The Nature of Our Way and study it. Let your soul be reintroduced to the mystery and find the joy within again. I'm so glad you guys are here. I hope this is uh, giving you something a little bit to, to think about today. And I'm so thankful you're here. Listen, if you want to join the Order of the Purple Cord, uh, go over to my website, robert-hickman.com. Send me an email. Let me know you want to join. Uh, we've got the certificate, I believe, over there. You can print it out. Uh, also, you can go over to Lady Angela's store, rarewickaspells.com. She has links there as well, and she can help you if you run into problems. Uh, also, visit her YouTube channel, which is Rare Wicca Spells. So I'll put the links for all that below. I am so glad you're here, guys. Listen, um, if you didn't see yesterday's video, also check that out. Uh, we talked about an Arturian portal that I discovered. And uh, you can learn how to connect with the Arturians through that. Very fascinating. So if you haven't seen that, check it out. It's right before this. Anyways, hope you'll, you'll stay with Spirit Channel. Like this video, favorite. Share it with your friends. Let's get the word out. Invite your friends to come join Spirit Channel. Invite them to join the Order of the Purple Cord. And let's grow our community of light here. I thank you guys for all your support. Listen, hit that subscribe also. We'd love you to be with us more regularly. Uh, it's free to join. doesn't cost anything. And you'll get all the updates. We're so glad you're here. Send you guys my blessings. And I'm going to just get my staff. And I think I'm going to go out and walk now and study the sun as it sets and watch the shadows of the trees and commune with the earth. Blessings to all of you. Good night.